Uh, do I have gifts? No, I do. Certainly, it's not the sharpest. How? Overcrowding, really? Is there no school over here? What? Why are there so many people going to that one school? Alright, I guess uh, I'll put a new school in. I didn't, didn't have this problem on my other file. It's just like if you built one school within like a chunk of, you know, one of these quadrants, uh, you would be good. But then again, on that one, I built with uh, measuring how everything very specifically. I'm not sure you guys want to see me do that on here, but I actually might do it, start doing it after the light resonances. I mean, now that I've done this, it's kind of just done. You know, that's just what happens. I'm also not probably going to make a seaport. I might make an airport, but I don't know. This thing's polluted so much. I don't know if I'm going to do it. We'll see. Uh, on other notes, um, I this this uh, series, you heard me in the beginning talk about how oh, this is... What's going on here? Furnaces. Is this is this medium? Was this supposed to be medium? Oh my gosh, that makes me feel so stupid. Are you serious? I don't want medium yet. So these can be medium, but the rest of this is going to be low. I don't even care. I'm done. No. Oh, low heads with big thoughts. Good. There you go. Quite a reputation. That I suggest you keep doing. Okay. Um. Yeah. Uh, residential taxes. Alright, I'm not gonna lower them if people don't start leaving. Unless people start leaving. Do water meters. No, yeah, sure. Um, plenty of schools. Supposed to be in tax relief. Yeah, so uh, I had said in the beginning that this is throwback. For those of you who don't understand what I mean by that or uh, didn't pay attention in the first episode or whatever. This is kind of going to be an ongoing series, and it's not going to just be SimCity. It's going to be, I'm going to play one game at a time, so I'm not just going to uh, start another game out of the blue. Uh, but if I do, well, when I do, I guess not beat this, but I guess fill up this town, sort of get done with it, and uh, feel sick of it or something like that. I don't know when I'll stop, but uh, I'll try to make it a good point to stop whenever I do maybe blow up my town who knows um, we will try to I'll go to something else and uh, then I'll have some suggestions uh, I, I can tell you what I would like to do or some games that I used to play what are you serious they're building a farm in the middle of the town that is awesome I've never had that happen before I've had a farm happen before but I usually find that farms are actually a waste of time to try to make because they usually end up turning into just industries anyway. Uh, but usually you have to make them like out like here, <laughs> in my experience. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be doing a bunch of games that... Um, the point of the series is that I do games that I played as a kid, and some of them I still play now, but basically games that I really liked, and uh, I would like to play on YouTube and record because I feel like they're maybe entertaining or fun. I really like them. I'd like to see you or let you see me playing them and I'd also just like to play them again because it's, it's fun to go back and you know do the things you used to love on your when you were a kid just like you like to go back and watch the movies you watched when you were a kid and stuff like that. I like to go back and play those games sometimes and some of the ones I do are like Zoo Tycoon, Roller Coaster Tycoon, yeah, any tycoon game. Uh, I'd also like to do The Sims. Uh, hopefully if I can arrange to get a better computer I will actually start a Let's Play on Sims 4 when it comes out which I know will be pretty cool because S Sims Let's Plays are typically by women <laughs> and I don't know if that says something bad about myself but uh, I hope not because I'm gonna do it and hopefully that will be uh, pleasing to some people because I, it is hard to find a male voice doing uh, Sims Let's Plays. I always invented it. Okay. Well. So, um, okay. yeah, it's hard to find a male doing a lot of Sims Let's Plays. And I would really like to do it, and uh, I'd like to do it where like I play it and I buy like the expansion packs you guys want me to buy, uh, not necessarily get all of them. 
because I'm a poor college kid, but maybe get a few of them according to, you know, what you guys think would be be coolest to get. You know, yeah, I just did that. So, uh, and, you know, just sort of uh, add what you want. You know, necessities, obviously, there will be a Sims 4 Pets, and I personally like Sims 4 Seasons, and that's maybe Sim and Sims, well, I guess there may not be a Sims 4 Seasons, but... Uh, I know there will be a Sims 4 Pets. That will probably be the first, that probably comes out not far after the launch of Sims 4. Librarians throw the book at. Okay. Let me put in a library then. There you go. Apparently, I haven't had enough fun stuff in here, guys. So let's let's add some stuff. Let's get some land value, and uh, I'm not really going to worry about it too much, the whole land value of this area, because uh, now that I've played on here and played a little bit uh, in my free time, I've started to remember some of the tactics, and I've listened to my counsel, and I've learned a little bit, and hopefully I'm I'm bouncing back, and uh, I, did, I did remind myself in uh, playing on my own that uh, you do have to... You do have to go go red sometimes, and that's something I've been really avoiding on here. But I realize that sometimes you have to go uh, you have to go red before you can go green, and that's a bummer. And it's a bummer that I'm gonna only make that much money. But alas, like I said, you have to you have to do it sometimes, and that's actually true for real life. You have to spend money to make money, guys, and that's the reason I'm at college right now. And uh, I mean, there's. You know, people invest money and, uh, you know, stuff like that. So, you have to spend money to make money. And that's a good life lesson. Alright, I'm going to build these blocks now. And it doesn't even matter to me the measurements yet. So, well, actually, it matters to me a little bit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Oh no, okay. I gotta go like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Alright, and then we have that, and then we just need to take him back up here. Oh, and that's not good. Alright, so we'll do that. Um, and then we'll cut this in half. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, Seems like 35. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So I guess we'll have to go to 18 because. Yeah. That makes sense. Alright. And that, and then I'm just going to cut it like that because that's how the old ones were, and I want it to be sort of at least somewhat of the. Almost perfect square grid. You know, not perfect completely, but the next, my next sections when I actually go back to doing medium will definitely be more mathematically uh, square. Because I think a square grid is the way to go, and it's actually important to keep your transportation fluid in this game. So, that is actually very important in this game. It makes Makes them quite mad, as uh, you can imagine. Uh, and as living in St. Louis, I can tell you for a fact, people get very mad about their uh, their poorly flowing traffic, and they're very into their mass transit. And I'm I, I was quite into mass transit next last year until uh, I could have a car on campus. Now I'm not not so much into mass transit, but hey, I'm all for it. I mean, if it's saving you money, it will save me money. I just don't drive much because. Uh, I don't have much of anywhere to go because I'm a smart kid who saves his money rather than going out and getting drunk every night. That's a little advice, guys. The people, you know, we had lots of people who we came to school and uh, people get caught up in the 
yay, I'm at college, uh, let's go drinking thing, and, you know, let's party it up, and, you know, your parents will tell you that, and people will tell you that, and you just kind of roll your eyes, you know, because, you know, oh, yeah, your people party, it, they're not being, they're not lying, I mean, they, they're telling you the truth, people, there's people that will go to uh, school, go to college, and, uh, on my colleges, it costs thirty-five to forty thousand dollars a year to go here. You know, it's not a cheap school by any sense of the word. And people will still come out here, and they'll fail out their first year, their second year. They'll get kicked out, and, and they'll or they'll go into professional years. The first two years are the easy years. The next four are the harder ones. I'm in my last uh, quote-unquote easy year, and then next year starts my uh, three hard years, and then my last year is rotations where I basically just am an intern at six different pharmacies. And, uh, um, basically people will just come, they'll fail, and, uh, the school will actually pass a good amount of people who don't deserve to be passed into f all the way to fourth year, just because they're just as happy to take your money when you're failing as <laughs> if you're not failing. You're not wasting their time, you're wasting your own time, so they don't really care if you're failing right now. And they, they kick some people out, like if I were to start failing, they'd kick me out because I go to school on loans, and because uh, I'm too poor to pay for my own school. But you know, if you're paying a good amount of your school, they, they're they probably not kicking you out here. And uh, that's my son. Yeah. That's jobs, boys. Parking fines, yeah. Yeah. Just sort of give them the, what they want, guys. Give the people what. I know, you always want schools, old, old guy. Jeez. Alright, let's just throw this with our stuff right here. Ooh. Ooh, that didn't sound good, did it? Let's see. No inmates in there. 82 in there. Jeez. I did not need the second prison. Maybe. I'm not going to destroy it. That'd be a waste of money. Um, I want to go ahead and make the fire station and then I want to make parks park 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 now normally uh, after we start getting into the medium residences you see what I'm doing with the parks I'm just slapping them down all the ooh save on all right I'll start slapping them down all over the place now when I get rich I'm gonna start doing that with bus stations but uh, when I get medium I mean but I'll be putting them in more organized ways. I should probably be putting them down already, but um, I'm going to wait to do that, I think. Uh, build a casino? Alright. Works for me. Um, casino. Let's go by the haunted house. I'm pretty sure they don't like the casino, but you can, they're going to have to get over it, I guess. It's not a thing. Who is left out of the rain? Uh, water is probably one of my least favorite things on here. Because it's something about Sims for some reason want to drink. Drink a bunch of chunks. You know? They like their water for some reason. I don't understand, I guess. But uh, yeah, I was saying, you know, if you do go to college, uh, whether you do or not, even if you're in high school, grade school, whatever, you know, take your education seriously because that's just going to be important. You know, whether you go to college or not, and uh, I know not everybody can, and uh, I wouldn't have been able to unless I got. Uh, except the fact that I got the scholarships that I got, and I uh, am fortunate enough to have a great grandpa who uh, has a good amount of money and helped me a little bit. But uh, luckily, I qualified for lots of loans, and uh, that's how I'm going to get through the rest of my school. My scholarships sort of got me in here, and now that I'm in here, it's easier to get scholar or to get loans once you're started and keep yourself going. With look at that, I'm so positive. And uh, it's pretty, it's pretty good. And uh, I, I really suggest you try to get to take, take your education seriously. And you know, there's no shame in online courses and things like that. And uh, I mean, I take online courses uh, as a supplement to my current college plan. I really take education seriously because it is, it's definitely important. I'm glad that uh, I've pursued what I have. It is hard, and I don't plan on it. Or I don't see it getting easy anytime soon. And to some people, it, it seems like, you know, that's just, you know, a losing battle and it's not going to go well. But to me, I, you know, I'm willing to take the challenge. And, uh, you know, I'm kind of excited for the day when maybe it gets hard enough for me to try because I haven't really had to try a lot in my my schooling. 
I don't mean to be like braggy when I say that, but I mean just altogether I really haven't had to try that hard in my school, so it would be pretty cool to. Uh, it is pretty nice to have a challenge, and uh, I'm willing to meet that challenge. So that's the important thing that. Oh, okay. I'll put a hospital on real quick. Isn't that, did I just build a hospital right here? What is this thing? No, oh, it's a museum. I didn't think it would be a hospital. Uh, power uh oh. We should pause. See how much it's producing. It's time to put in a new power plant. Um, another power plant? Yep, another power plant. Alright. I guess I'm going to spend all my money on that too, huh? It's actually a good idea to uh, have excess power plants I've found. Uh, you know, you could sell power, but I find that selling stuff gets you in a lot of trouble in the end. But mainly because uh, sometimes your power plants melt down, blow up. Uh, what happened there? I'm sorry, this is kind of stupid probably, but I gotta delete that. I don't know what. Oh, no, I don't, apparently. Well, let's at least build a road out to it. <laughs> I'll keep it there until it's uh, a bad, a bad uh, in bad position and I need it out of the way, I guess. Uh, I can't really do anything right now, so let's just look around and see what's going on.